Hello everybody, my name is Ethix, welcome to Mindful SMP. This is going to be a different episode, it's going to consist of me showing you what I've been doing primarily on live streams, then I'm going to get a beacon, then I'm going to go and do a secret Santa thing, and it's going to be a fun time. Hope you enjoy. Alright, so, since the last time I really checked in in the video, I'm not sure. I've been doing a bit of live streaming because I've been doing a lot of work and I just don't feel like all this digging and, and building and minor detail stuff is going to be interesting in the video. So I'd rather just show you what I've done and move on from there. If you go into the playlist, which hopefully I'll remember to put at the top right, right up here right now, you can uh, check out the, the VODs of the live streams themselves. One of the things that I've done recently is I built this little storage system, which simply opens up like that. It's an old school kind of idea and I just find it really fun. So I've been getting rid of all my chest monsters and putting all of my good stuff in here, which really isn't a lot. <laughs> so I'm going along with a very industrial style architecture, if you want to consider it as such. So I'm digging this big line here out of our main water dome. It's more of an air dome. Think about Sandy's place from SpongeBob. If you've ever seen it, you know, if you know, you know. One addition that I added here is I got a little slime in here and you will see on screen how big of an issue that was to get, but worth it. I think I'm going to try and add a few more, but we will see about that. Hey, I don't know if you know this, but Mindful SMP is actually really cool and so are the people on it. And so is MC Pro Hosting, who sponsor Mindful SMP. If you're looking to set up your own server, go over to their website, use code MINDFUL for 20% off your plan. Thank you, MC Pro Hosting. I added some custom trees in here, and I'm really happy that the way with the way that they came out. One thing that I want to do is I want to create a bit more stuff in here, such as like park benches and foliage and just stuff that makes it feel like Ashley lived in. Something that looks and feels welcoming when you come down the whirlpool. This is about the only bit of greenery that we're going to have in the entire area. That's why it's the entrance to the whole thing. The rest of it's going to be very industrial, kind of dark and grungy and full of metal and stuff. This is one tunnel that I just finished. I think I'm happy with it. I don't know if I'm going to change anything from here, but we will see. I have some glass on the ceiling so that you can kind of get some daylight, even though there's no daylight down here. But it's a skylight nonetheless. I had some on the walls here, but I just wanted it to be on the ceiling because I wanted this to feel more like a, a piping, like industrial piping from one place to another, which you can kind of see out there. I built this one first, so it's a little bit different, but I'm okay with that because it's a completely different section of the base. Here is where we are going to have different, they aren't statues, but I guess they're, there's probably a good word for it that is just not in my brain, but I'm putting faces of all the people on the server. So there's Lautner, there's me, and all the way down here, I'm going to be making pretty much everybody's face through different areas, probably like I did with my storage system right here. In between the faces, I might add some different small farms like potato, carrot, wheat, like that kind of stuff. I'm going to avoid entities such as cows and stuff because I don't want to lag the server. I'm being very careful with redstone down here. As I'll show you in this next clip, I got a beacon with Lautner's help. <sighs> okay, I have a feeling this is going to go poorly. <laughs> mm. Moment of truth. At least it'll have distractions with all the intermen. Oh, dude, you I mean, want to get out of there. <laughs> I was trying to see. I don't think it... Quite... Okay. Thank goodness. Yay! Turn that way, way down. It was weird, it was suffocating at first, but that might have been good. Yeah, he does suffocate. And pop. Oh god. The heck? <laughs> ah. There must be a thing Thank around here. You. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so we got that for haste, which I couldn't have done this without it. I don't have TNT, and I'm definitely not digging all this out one block at a time without haste. So that's really about it. I had D's help with some honey over at her shop. I put in a custom order and she delivered in very fast timing. It was like Amazon, 
but it was D instead. I talked to her about payment and I paid her kind of off camera. I just dropped off some diamonds at her house. So my idea is that I'm going to be building another kind of dome area over here and that's going to be another farm section. And then that's also going to branch off into another area. Each wall here, one, two, and three, we already got one started. So each wall, there's going to be more piping leading on to different sections of the underwater areas. So I will see you in the next clip. I don't know what it's going to be. All right, here's a small sidetrack from what we were previously doing in the video, but it is Christmas time. That means that we have a secret Santa going on on the Mifel server, and I have yet to pick out, well, I have yet to dr get my draw name. How do I say that and not sound like an idiot? What am I trying to say? I need to press a button, get a draw name, and then I need to uh, figure out a gift for said person. So... There are two people in here. I did look and I have a 50 50 chance. So who we get. It's broken. <laughs> I, of course. Okay. Well, I know what to get this dude. I'm going to put my gift together for him and then I will see you over at the Christmas area. Oh yeah. I also am tagged right now. We have a game of tag going on in the server. So I need to go tag somebody. <laughs> TNT trap. <laughs> Oh, that, oh, oh. <laughs> this is possibly one of the longest nether tunnels I've ever walked down, but we are finally at the Christmas town, and this is the first time I've seen it at all. I want to record my reaction. Oh, <laughs> nice. Oh, hello there. This is a, uh, this is a perfect time to do something that I believe needs to be done. How you doing, bud? Ah, my bad. <laughs> there we go. No longer tagged. <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. This this place is beautiful. So here is our tree, I suppose. This is awesome. Some are signed, some aren't. So I shall create a sign, I suppose. You know what? I'll put mine right up in front and center for Brogan. All right, so here is Brogan's gift. I just want to show this on camera because I feel kind of proud of it. I'm not extremely rich. I don't have a lot to offer, but I feel like the, the things that I gave him are well thought out. I got a couple soul torches for the redhead himself. Got some sponges, which he's asked for previously. Got a few whips because I know he likes those. Got him some of the best wood in the game. Some diamonds, a golden apple, and some pearls. Got a child's tear as well. Can't forget that. So there you go, Brogan. I know that this is a secret Santa, but uh, I don't have to worry about you watching this video anyway because you don't watch my video. So while we're here. Hi. I don't like the way he's looking at me. <laughs> I knew we were getting festive, but I didn't know how festive. This place is beautiful. Good work to Copper Raven and, and Black Panda and a few others that I'm sure have helped. I think they've done most of the work and they're definitely the ones here. So applause to them. This place is gorgeous. I love all the different heads. We got gingerbread houses. We got whatever. I'm assuming those are reindeer or something. I'm not really sure. I don't know what that is i think it might be a snow globe i think that's i think that's a snow globe of course we got the elves you can't forget the elves oh boy <laughs> well this is this is an easy fix i'm not gonna lie ah well i guess we gotta wait i love the lights they're so maybe they're bells i think those are actually bells i don't know they look cool I love this little tree too. Oh, and and the floating like lights there. I think we have those in like hidden item frames. I am not walking through that tunnel again. Shit. <laughs> come on, come on. Let the timer run out. Yes! <laughs> yeah! Let's go! <laughs> And that's where I call it a day while I'm recording this now. <laughs> the very last second I got that tag. <laughs>